What's going on? I am awesome because I've made these workouts up. I made all these workouts up. Now you see in this example, you have to lean back when you're doing the the exercise and I came up with this um, no one else did I mean how how is that possible so as you saw there it's original content here so you want to start and you want to stagger your stance so when you actually complete the movement and and you want to do it fast because you know and staggered because just because you just listen to me because I know what I'm talking about I know what I'm doing so I'm re I'm reestablishing my stance I'm bending at the knees a little bit and here real quick we get into what I call the uh, J rows so you need to pull back into your scapular region and you actually want to abdominally abduct your scapula together and push your bones together and that'll actually expand your chest if you're doing chest day so you want to do these every day make sure you do these every day okay uh, you can even do these when you're doing a chest day you can do them when you're doing a bicep day you can do them whenever you want to do them you can even do them like the guy over there who's swinging around you can do them on those days too and then you jump right into a non-assisted. Now, there, never mind what I'm doing with my with my leg there. A non-assisted pull-up, and you want to angle your body and flex your core because that's going to make your pull-ups that that much more easy and effective for you to do and to target your back. So next, we're going to go on to another thing that I created. And this is to isolate and, again, using your abdominal abductor schmuckters and stuff like that. You want to actually pull across your body to uh, stretch the pectoral major and minor. And then when you push across your body, it's going to flex your pectorials. Both of them at the same time. This is not an isolated movement. Where is it? Yes. No. Wait. Yes. It's an isolated movement. So it isolates one arm at a time. Because in a minute here, you're going to see that I'm going to switch. And this is even a better view because you'll be able to actually see my text because of the direction of the angle of the camera angle. So you're going to be better able to see actually how my chest flexes. Or not. Wait. Huh? Hmm. Anyway. Forget what I just said there. Um, I'll go back and edit that. Or you know what I mean. So this you can see the rotation of the spine. So that's very important. So make sure that you're abdominally abducting your productors. And being productive. Now let's get into actually... <sighs> The not so funny part. This is actually um, what I would do for chest. Uh, <laughs> the beginning part was just, uh, you know, for fun. So here uh, I have to actually fiddle with my right hand because it's being squirrely on me because I have the CPs, our cerebral palsy, so it gets squirrely which bodybuilding or pushing weight around actually helps that greatly. So I had to fix my hand on the lower portion. The reason I'm doing the lower portion, and this is real, this part's real, is it's a little less stress on my shoulders. i um, been having a bit of shoulder issue um, with the last few months. Um, of working out so again because I'm in the gym late night uh, I, I essentially own the gym at this hour when I go uh, it, it keeps me in check in a good way because I can't push it I can't I don't have a spot so 
I uh, can't be stupid, uh, and I'm too old to be stupid. Um, so here, uh, frankly, I'm just warming up again. My warm-up is with the machine, just to get the blood flowing, get the blood into the, into the muscles. Here, I'm using the Smith, and it's not one of those Smith that's on an angle, it's straight up and down. So I'm just doing reps, and right here you can kind of see how I'm taking my pinky off the bar. So I'm trying to concentrate on actually using my chest to push the bar versus my arms, i.e. triceps, shoulders, uh, even though I know it's a compound movement, um, not daft. So uh, at this point, this is the where I maxed out again because I didn't want to overdo it. I just put three tens on either side. Um, and of course you need that swing juice, right? All right. Um, so, I mean, the, should I add that I used to be in the military because I own a Jeep and, or that I helped the Eagles win the Super Bowl because I've been, I, I wear a Eagles uh, shirt. Would you believe that? I, 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 I hope not. So anyway, uh, last few here are a bit of a struggle because I actually haven't been in the gym for about three and a half weeks, four weeks. And I gave up trying to put it on that uh, upper notch. So I had to squirrel my way through here. So if you like this, give me a like, give me a follow. Do all that stuff with the thumbs up button, and um, I'll catch you in the next one. I hope you enjoyed this and had some fun. I had some fun making it.